What is intermittent fasting? Well, it turns out there's three types of intermittent fasting. The first one is what we call caloric restriction, which is probably the oldest form of intermittent fasting. There's been lots of studies to suggest that if you decrease your diet intake by 15% or even to 40, depending how much you were overeating previously, that you can actually reduce all causes of chronic conditions. Now the more recent version is time-restricted caloric. The second type is time-restricted fasting. So some people are saying, I don't eat breakfast. Some people say, I only eat for 12 hours a day. Some people say, I only eat dinner. And that is a more modern way. And the third one is periodic fasting. And that, in my classic view of that, is traditions like Ramadan, where you don't eat from sunrise to sunset and so it reduces your caloric intake to almost 25%. Everybody asks me, so is it good or is it bad for you? Well, it depends. It depends if you're trying to lose weight. It depends if to begin with you are caloric rich or nutrient rich. And if you are starving yourself already and you starve yourself some more, it's not helpful. It depends on your metabolism and your blood work. So that is how we can determine intermittent fastings of all sorts is good for you.